gods, their families and servants had ruled and reigned through time. Their word was thunder, their love was death. The German people had served and obeyed them, and they had battled and conquered in their name. Then the gods quarreled among themselves, and too intent upon slaying one another, to watch their step. They stumbled into the twilight where there shone no light of adoration and where there was not the night of unconsciousness. They could not forget their old power and they were unhappy in their uselessness. Foes though they had been to one another, when they fell to their quarreling, they were like one in their misery, and they cried as with one voice. Because your power 
if I may be candid, is just a whiff of words. Unless you're recognized as God's by praying for Now, I can make them pray to you. But there's a price to pay. Make it! I want a soul! Souls! We give away. They are the currency of lesser gods than we. We give them flesh. The flesh to adore us. The flesh to fear us. The flesh to belong to us. So the bargain was struck. Following the First World War, the German people danced upon the ashes of their glory to the driving strains of despair and poverty. The general stands erect, his, his child dies of neglect, so he makes another one. The general goes to bed, his fist in an iron glove. He wishes he'd never wed and made war instead of love. Their life was a parody of living, their philosophy a panache of falsehood. They are my lost.
my alter ego on earth. Dieses deutsche Volk, ein Vorführung durch eine Arbeit, durch einen Fleisch, eine Entschlossenheit, einen Trotz, eine Beharrlichkeit, dann werden wir wieder den Vorstein, genau wie die Täter einst auf Deutschland nicht geschenkt erhielten, sondern selbst nicht schaffen mussten. A storm was gathering. March. March, march. The earth began to tremble under the coarse rhythm of goose-stepping boots, which trampled down flowers and march. stone, march. beauty march. and law. And in horror, the earth itself raised the voice of things remembered March. and things March. foreseen. March. 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 Be 
servant build a fire with the books of which you disapprove. That fire will both warm me to my cause and to the cockles of your godly heart. Bonfires were built and the land was ablaze with the orchard of fe of thought itself. Thus the stage was set for the new prophet of the old gods who had come to dazzle the world with the religion of force and his wiles were his wisdom.
Conceived by treachery and deceit, grew. Conquest followed conquest, and the myth of invincibility intoxicated the priests of human debasement. A whole continent had become freedom's jail, and the threnody of the imprisoned was the executioner's hymn of ecstasy. the spirit of resistance could not be crushed. And the free men of the world gather together to stand for their liberty or perish in its defense. One voice spoke their determination when it said, we shall go on to the end. We shall fight in the seas and ocean. We shall fight in the air. We shall fight on the beaches. We shall fight in the fields and in the streets. We shall fight in the mountains and the hills. We shall never surrender. Satan! Satan! You have no 
soul which I could slowly pay. You're no good to me. I disavow you. You're more evil than hell itself and the world. So alone, forsaken even by the devil, bereft of allies, in reason and compassion, the conspiracy collapsed, foaming and whining with self-pity as the fire which it had started was driven across its borders and into the cellar beneath the hell above. There, heartless and mindless as it had lived, it died miserably by its own doing.
Yeah. 